in the future. One, privately issued, private, privately issued cryptocurrencies. Two, central bank digital currencies, or CBDCs for short. <clears throat> Three, tokenized bank liabilities. And four, well-regulated stable coins. Cryptocurrencies, private cryptocurrencies, have failed the test of digital money. They have performed poorly as a medium of exchange or store of value. Their prices are subject to sharp speculative swings. Many investors in these cryptocurrencies have suffered significant losses. The next contender, wholesale CBDCs and second and third contenders, wholesale CBDCs and tokenized bank li liabilities. Now, these can play the role of digital money and help to achieve atomic settlement because they correspond to the existing monetary system, which comprises central bank notes and coins and bank deposits. So you have CBDCs and tokenized bank liabilities. Since 2016, MAS has conducted many experiments with other central banks and the financial industry to explore the use of wholesale CBDCs on distributed ledgers to facilitate real-time cross-border payments and settlements. We will take our experiments a step further next year. I'm pleased to announce that MAS will pilot the live issuance of wholesale CBDCs to instantaneously settle payments across commercial banks here. Now, previously, MAS had only simulated the issuance of wholesale CBDCs within test environments. We will now go further into live. We will partner the local banks to pilot the use of wholesale CBDCs as a common settlements asset in domestic payments. So banks will issue tokenized bank li liabilities that represent claims on their balance sheets by their retail customers, right? Now, the retail customers will be able to use these tokenized bank liabilities in transactions with merchants who can in turn credit these tokenized bank liabilities with their respective banks. Now, the outstanding interbank obligations arising from these transactions will be settled via an automatic transfer of wholesale CBDCs that the banks are holding. So clearing and settlement occurs in a single step on the same infrastructure. Unlike the current system in which clearing and settlement take place on different systems and settlement occurs with a lag. 